hi everybody welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how you going to fry your chicken your chicken not going to have no blood inside is because by one of my describers and also i'm going to show how to make a chicken sauce with cashew and i'm going to show you what you need okay okay what you're going to do you can buy yourself that cashew i buy the natural one so when you buy it, what you're going to do, you put on a water for at least for 15 minutes to suck, to, to suck in. So, and then by the time you get your chicken ready, okay? All right. Okay, so what you're going to do when you finish, put your seasoning. I already put couples of the chicken in my season. So if you're going to fry your chicken, when you're born to boil in it, what you're going to do, you uh, you cut it. So that's going to uh, help you to cook for the for you to cook the chicken inside it. So when you're going to fry the chicken, it's not going to have um, blood inside. Okay, I'll show you how I make. So right now I put my chicken. I'll give this season my chicken. Now I'm going to put my chicken boiling for me to start doing my chicken. Mm, that's good. Okay, you can see my chicken already uh, boiling is already cooked. So I'm going to show you something. You see, you don't see no blood in it. So that's the place where you cut in it. You see, it's no blood. So what you're going to do, you're going to fry it, and I'll show you how it's going to look. Okay, after. guys, when you ready, what you're going to do, you take off your chicken. From the sauce, you, you uh, from the from the seasoning spice, you put some water and you you take it off from that. But then what you're going to do, make sure you put a piece of the chicken inside. That's why I did to make sure your your oil is really hot. Now what you're going to do, you slice the chicken. If you want, you can put um just a corn bread in it and everything you want. Okay, guys, you can see I already cut my chicken. Okay, so I'm opening up for the view. Is you're not going to find no blood at all because of the cut you make. Okay, you can see is no problem. So the problem is when you when you doing it, it got blood in it. Maybe you don't you don't cook it enough because if you don't cook it enough. Is going to give you blood. It's, you're going to find blood on the middle. You can see? No blood at all. Okay, guys? All right. Okay, what you're going to do, you put your oil, and I put two teaspoons of tomato paste. I put I drop my cashew to make it a little bit changing color. But you don't need you don't need to do that if you don't want the cashew to be um, overcooked. Okay? I'm going to add my onion. And this one is the sauce of the chicken was boiling. You put the sauce was burning the chickens. Okay, you can see I already add the rest of uh, my seasoning uh, sauce. You can see it tastes good. So you have to taste it to see how you like it. If you want it a little bit more, more spice. Or hot, you add what you what you, what what you like, and then leave it boiling for 15 minutes, and then you add your chicken. Remember, your chicken already boiling, and your chicken already fried. So if you don't want the chicken to fry, don't fry. If you have cornerstone wall, what you want to do, boiling your chickens, 
and then you make your sauce and then you drop drop the chicken like that with your with your onion with your cashew you don't need to find nothing okay so I'll show you the next result now I'm going to put some black paper in it the original one I shake it two times now you're going to add your chicken you put your sauce on low low or medium okay and then you put it on low and then you make sure you 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 taste your cashew to make sure if you want it more soft or if you want it do uh, the way you like it thank you for watching leave a comment below you know what to do so thank you I'll show the results.